I'm here in Santa Ana at the Firestorm Free Running and Aerobics Gym. And as you can see behind me, we have a lot of stuff going on. But I came here to speak to one particular person that stands out from the group. Let's go meet her now. With elegance and grace, Michelle Andrews defies gravity, and her body has few limitations. With ease, she floats, balances, and bends her body in ways most of us only wish we could. While talking to fellow gymnast Lauren Guth, I asked, what has stood out to you while watching Michelle train? Uh, definitely the uh, ha hand balancing stuff and the contortion is like really cool. Anything in particular that she did during that that just really stood out to you? Um, I don't know what it's called, but she, she was in a handstand and her feet came over her face, by her face, and it was very, very cool because I'm really jealous that I can't do that. Is it something that you would want her to maybe show you how to do sometime? Uh, she, she can try really hard, but I don't know if my back does that. So is there anything that you would say is real hard um, when it comes to training here? What are, the, what are some of the challenges that you face when you're training and some of the challenges that you may have noticed uh, Michelle facing? Probably um, the biggest challenge is, is being open to doing a lot of the stuff in there because there's so many different things to do at this gym that you really have to be open to what other people are doing to be able to learn. How do you feel about the people here? Probably that everyone's so talented and everybody's so willing to show each other what they're doing and able to share what they're doing so that everyone can learn. After hearing such kind words, I thought I'd go speak to TK, who's worked closely with Michelle. How long have you been training with Michelle? Two years now. And how has it been working with Michelle for those two years? It, it's definitely entertaining. <laughs> so you're basically uh, a coach and dance partner for her? Mm, yeah, I would say like an acro partner. What do you enjoy the most about working with Michelle? It's very entertaining. <laughs> she definitely has a personality that really clicks. So. What would you say are some areas that she needs to work on? Confidence. <laughs> personality. <laughs> She's got a good personality, but as soon as people have to see it, it kind of hides a little bit. <laughs> it's a little shy at times. <laughs> Explain to us some of the things that you do. Um, I do a little bit of everything. Uh, my career in this acrobatic world started out heavily in gymnastics competitively and then I moved to dance. Um, but today I do a lot of contortion, hand balancing, aerial silks is one of my favorites. Um, just got into a Daggio at TK and I also do Lyra as well, which is the hoop that's in the air. What is Daggio? I'd say a Daggio is like a swing dance, but it has more like acrobatics, like flips and balancing and partner skills in that sense. How would you describe? Contortionism. Buddy who's really, really abnormally flexible. Okay. <laughs> yes. What are some of your favorite things to do? Um, out of all the stuff that you named, what would be the one that you just enjoy doing the most? Um, silks, because it's like a dance up in the air, and I love dance, I love music, and, you know, it's fun to flow on the silks with it, and the drops are fun, and I love spinning. Okay. Spinning's my favorite. TK, how do you feel about Michelle's progress? She's on a good pace right now. She's... She's working on her personality, showing, uh, expressing herself towards the audience when she's on silk. She's doing well at that now. Is that the progress you wanted to make? Uh, that's what I want. That's what I'm going for. That's what you're going for? Yeah. And he's, he's honest. He's a hard critic. So coming from him, that's great. That means a lot. Okay. I'm going to keep pushing for it. Right. Not get lazy. Now, do you plan on working together in other areas or just more or less the silks and some of the... the um... Mostly like probably silks and adagio at this point. I mean, if other partner things happen to come up, then we typically train together while we're here. We've we become like, I feel like good friends over time. What's new for you training wise? Pole, I'm getting more into pole. Okay. Acrobatic pole. Acro <laughs> Glad we clarified that. So what, oh, type of th what type of things would you like to do with that? And is this the man that's going to help you get there? <laughs> I don't know. TK is like a box of tricks. He's good at everything. Oh, also uh, tramp wall. It's where you bounce on your back and do flips and run up the wall. And wow. Yeah, so I've dabbled in that just a tiny bit. What does this life mean to you? It's my passion and I live, eat, and breathe this stuff. I guess the old saying holds true. You can do anything you put your mind and heart into. You just have to ask yourself, 
how bad do I want it? Oh, and if you thought I was going to leave this place without having a little fun myself, oh, you're so wrong. I'm Cozy Johnson Jr. reporting from Santa Ana with Fullerton News.